This is ground zero boom, and this is where your your toast, and this is where you might be a little crispy. It's 120 feet. The center of the gas line is 120 feet to the edge of the house. And the main thing that destroys communities is having one damn industry control everything, and it controls the politicians, it controls the school systems, it controls the banks, it controls everything in the area. You were at the mercy of them, and then when they fail, everybody fails. So you went from a handful of vehicles and a school bus now and then to having hundreds and hundreds of trucks a day. Do you see the water buffalo? There's their water buffalo. There's a water buffalo. Never looked like that before. They come to town. If I walk on my property, if I would walk up that field right now, there would be four trucks on that pad so fast, like I am a criminal in my own property. There's been several occasions that we've had to evacuate on spur of the moment. We basically just fled. It really feels as though we really don't have any property rights. Ultimately, if there are minerals under your property and they want it, they're gonna get it one way or another. And where do you go? It's just, it's a big fight. I mean, this is a $4.3 billion pipeline. I'm just a little man with a family. I have invested a lifetime of work here. You do all this work, develop this attachment, and somebody comes and takes it away from you, and relatively the blink of an eye.